Michigan State is heading back to the Final Four for the first time since 2015. It'll be the eighth trip for Tom Izzo as this Michigan State squad knocked off Duke in the East Region Final to punch their ticket to Minneapolis. You know, it's another thing like we have in our wallets. You know, two hours of work, 40 minutes of play, a lifetime of memories, and that's why they're all special to me. Uh, you know, I could say this team's more mentally tough than most. I could say Mateen's is more physically tough. I, I could say we got lucky a couple times. Being lucky and getting to a Final Four is still special. I promise. Oh, it feels great. You know, uh, to do it with this group is special. And, uh, you know, to help Coach Izzo get another one feels even better. You know, I love Coach Izzo. I'd do anything for him. I know he'd do anything for me. And that's what makes this place so special. We love each other. We're brothers. And uh, we're going to the Final Four. To send McQuaid out, to send Goins out, going to a Final Four, maybe a little bit more. How happy are you for the seniors? Extremely happy for Cueto. Kenny, this is the second time to a Final Four, so I'm jealous for him. Um, but I'm, I'm proud of those guys. They stepped up for us, and they helped us lead. And they're just great. These guys are on a mission, you know, and uh, they play so well together, but they're coached so well, too. So Coach Izzo, hats off. We love that he, we have them. And these, these uh, Spartan Nation, the fans should be happy. But I, I just saw one of a great college basketball game. But this is what I planned. I just, I just planned to be in the jersey. <laughs> well, I'm not in the jersey, but, I mean, it's just great to still be, to be able to experience this. Um, you know, I mean, this is a, every, everybody doesn't get to do this. You know, everybody don't get to experience things like this. So, you know, it's nothing, nothing but a blessing from God. So for a team that's continued to find another way all season, that has continued to fight all year, silencing all doubters, there's still more basketball to be played. In Washington, D.C., I'm Jamal Spencer, 13 on your side, sports.